All right, welcome back to BT. Let's talk some tennis right now. Of course, the young, talented stars that we have in this country have spiked the popularity of the sport, especially when you see the success that they've been having. Rogers Cup winner, of course, Bianca Andreescu, is a prime example of that, but it's a sport for all ages. Joining me right now from Tennis Canada is the manager of seniors, tennis, and events, Erwin Tobias. Good morning, Erwin. How are you? Good. Good morning. How are you, Devo? I'm great, thanks. Nice to see you again. Of course, last time we saw each other was at that Rogers Cup, and we're talking about the young talent that we've been seeing kind of just being groomed and going through the Tennis Canada program and shining right now. Bianca, uh, Dennis, of course, Chapo, and Felix as well. Yes, uh, they've been doing great, and we've also got some senior players that are really uh, doing well on the on the world stage as well. We've got the number one over 35 player in the world, Henry Choi, out of Vancouver, B.C., and uh, Tara Spiko uh, from Montreal last week in Lisbon, Portugal, won the over 50 world singles championship. And that's it. And that's what we're going to chat about in a second here with the tournament that you have going on this week, of course, uh, the Steve Stevens uh, tournament that we're going to chat about in a second, the seniors tournament. But let's talk about some of these younger stars yes. and what they've done to the popularity of the sport. Well, they've done very a lot, a lot for the popularity of the sport. Um, you know, tennis is, um, you know, it's a sport of lifetime and uh, you know, it's been fa fabulous, uh, you know, that it is also um, uh, gender neutral and 44% of the pr participants are also female. Uh -huh. And a key benefit for tennis is for seniors over 65, it's now representing 18% of the Canadian population, whereas a few years ago it was just 14%. And it's been great. This tournament, we have 550 entrants from across Canada. That's a record number of entrants playing in the event from ages 35, over 35, to over 85. That's incredible. Now let's talk about this. The Steve Stevens Seniors National Tournament, of course. Uh, you guys started off on Monday, was it? We started on Sunday. Sunday, yeah. Um, we have over 1,000 matches that we're playing this wow. week. The semifinals are, uh, are on today. Um, at six wonderful locations in Toronto that have opened the doors for us and the finals are on tomorrow so it's been a it's a seven-day event like I said Devo over a thousand matches are being played in 41 age categories that's incredible and you had of course Carl Hale who is the director for the Rogers Cup he was uh, playing in this tournament and you also had the world number one playing right um, yes Carl Hale is um, playing actually a semi-final match this morning. He is playing the number one seed and uh, the world champion, Tara Spako. So that's going to be a highlighted match on the schedule today for sure. That's incredible. Uh, of course, Erwin, have you been playing in this tournament or are you just kind of overseeing things? I know you like to get out there because we got to play each other well, at the Rogers Cup. Yeah, I'd love to play. I, I'm eligible for, I'm not going to say which age category, but it's uh, it's up there. And uh, I do play. I play a few times a week. I play singles and doubles, but I'm far too busy uh, uh, to get on the court for this event. That's it. And, you know, Erwin, you told me last time that it's, it's a sport for all ages. You know, if even you're a beginner, you can. it's never too late to get into it. What's the oldest uh, participant you have in the tournament this year? Uh, we have... Uh, um, an 87-year-old gentleman playing in the over 85 tournament. And uh, we also have Bob Robert Bedard, who is the legendary Robert Bedard, who uh, has won the Canadian Open, and he's playing in the over 80 age category. He's the number one seed in the, in, in the over 80 age category, and he's also playing doubles with Francois Gabot, who uh, was you know, a very highly ranked player as well out, out of Montreal. That's it. Erwin, can you give us some of those locations where people can check out the semifinals today and the finals tomorrow for the Steve Stevens Senior National Tourney? Yes. Uh, like I said, we opened the, the clubs opened the doors. We're at the Donalda Club uh, in Toronto, the Toronto Lawn Tennis Club, and the Granite Club. That's where the three, three main sites uh, for the tournament. And play will take place beginning at 8.30 a.m. 
on both days. Uh, that's so amazing. Erwin Tobias, thank you so much. Senior men's uh, tennis, of course, senior tennis and events at Tennis Canada, where you're the manager of that. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. The Steve Stevens Seniors National Tournament continues its semis today and finals tomorrow. If you get a chance, go check it out. Thank you so much, Erwin. Thank you.